Darn it. Darn it. Not with the little darn it. Hey, darn it. Celestia? Oh, it. Yeah. Are you okay? Fine. I, I'm great. Well, you don't sound great. Celestia? Somewhere out there, Luna. There's a pony. A pony that likes to play with fire. What? Yesterday, around noon, I received a tidal wave of letters filled to the brim with petty insults and libel. Oh dear, um, do you know who's sending these letters? No, the coward doesn't sign them, but I swear to you they will not get away with this. They will pay most dearly for their treachery. They think they can best me. They think they control me. No! They know nothing of the wrath they have unleashed upon themselves. Whoever you are, I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you! Hi. My name is Blank Flank. I'm kind of an idiot. Oh, uh... This is Snips. Uh... His special talent is scissors. Okay, uh... uh He's okay, kind uh, of an idiot, too. Okay, what... Do I know you, or...? What? Well, you just came over here and started talking to me. Like, I don't... Oh, yeah. <laughs> we do that sometimes. Okay, I I'm gonna go. There's like a... There's like a thing happening. What's every pony doing? We are waiting for the show to start. What show? Um, it said on the flyers that uh, there would be a magic show uh, today. Yeah, some great and powerful magician from the Inner Empire. Oh, wait. Great and powerful? Welcome, mares and stallions. Come and witness the amazing magical abilities of the great and powerful Trixie. <laughs> oh my god, my workers, would you look at that? That's Trixie. Oh my god, that's amazing. You've got to be kidding me. Watch in awe. As the great and powerful Trixie performs the most impossible feats of magic ever witnessed by pony eyes. Wow, such boasting. Yeah, she's so full of herself. I'm sorry. What? What makes you think you are the best? Calm down there, dude. My name is The Bird. Okay. It's only a show. Still, you shouldn't boast like that. Okay, well, would you rather Trixie say, come and watch the kind of average and kind of mediocre magical abilities of the great and powerful Trixie? Uh, no, not really. Besides, Trixie's magical abilities are something to boast about. No way. I bet I could do a trick better than you can. Really? You dare to challenge Trixie? Yes. Check this out. <laughs> As Trixie was saying, the great uh, and hello. I just did a trick. Yeah, she saw. Trixie wasn't impressed. How are you not impressed? I think I defied the laws of physics somewhere in there. Listen, bird. Trixie has been performing. Uh, it's pronounced the bird. Whoa. Wow. Anyone else have problems with Trixie's performance? Hey, listen, guys. I'm going to go before she notices me. No way. Well, well, well. Twilight Sparkle. Oh, God. My arch nemesis. Please stop. We meet again under the most unusual circumstances, yes? Yes. What are you doing nowadays, Twilight? Working at some dead-end job? Like a library or something? I happen to be Princess Celestia's top student. What are you doing now, Trixie? Performing parlor tricks for kids? No, this is just a job on the side. You know, make some money on practicing something you're good at. Kill two birds with one stone kind of thing. Wait, she does what now? Trixie's been studying, Twilight. Studying the most advanced and mysterious forms of magic in the world. That's nice. I don't really care. Don't you, Twilight? Uh, whoa. How... How did you do that? Pretty neat, huh? Trixie can change her voice at will. Okay. That, that's a new one on me. Recognize this voice, Twilight? Whoa, okay, that's just a little creepy. Can you do this, Twilight? Can you speak without moving your lips? Uh, and Trixie also knows everything you're about to say. What, what do, do you mean? mean? How, How are, are you, you doing that? <laughs> Trixie read the script. The script? Like some ancient text hey, or something? Oh, what? 
Hang what? On, hang on. I read this. Okay, there. I read the next two pages, so I'm good. What, what are, are you, you talking, talking about? Okay, that is seriously getting annoying. How are you doing that? <laughs> Trixie has discovered the ultimate power. You see, Trixie has come across the most peculiar force known as the Fourth Wall and has the ability to break it. It is a very dark power, and only the most evil of ponies can command it. For my ally is the fourth, and a powerful ally Whoa, it is to- Are you quoting Yoda? There are people watching us, Twilight. Right now. What? Hello, viewers. Yes, I'm talking to you. I just wanted to give a shout out to all those Trixie fans out there. I really owe a lot to you guys. Who is she talking to? I think she's gone crazy. What? Uh, no, no, there really are people watching us right now. Maybe you should see a doctor or something. But look, I can talk to the editor. <clears throat> Hello, the editor. Uh, you know, uh, I heard that uh, dress purchasing is the best way to cure insanity. Are you what? Wait, wasn't there supposed to be a show? You know, it's been fun catching up, but yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna go now. But arching is not stupid. It's, it's awesome. No, it's pretty dumb. Luna, poor Luna. So naive. <sighs> Here we go. God, what is that like? Okay, what's so great about having an arch nemesis? But are you kidding me? Two ponies trying to outwit each other in maniacal schemes of brilliance. It's amazing. But I I've got five. You have five arch nemeses? Uh, what, what's so funny? <laughs> well, I've never had to use the word nemesis in the plural sense before. <sighs> Jeez, Nips. I wish I could speak without moving my lips and change my voice. Hey, maybe Trixie can take us as her apprentices in learning the ways of the Force. Then maybe I'll be good at something for once. On. Ah, Twilight Spark, my arch nemesis. We meet again. Why the is there an Ursa Minor in the town? Don't look at me. These two brought it in. Yeah, we brought it here to prove our worth. We kind of suck like that. Yeah, they do suck. Okay, all right, I don't care. Watch in uh, awe as Trixie lifts the beast off the ground. Uh, Trixie, that's me who's lifting the Ursa Minor. No way. Trixie is lifting. Trixie, do you not see the magic coming from my horse? Trixie has the power to turn her magic invisible. No, you do not. Yes, Trixie does. She is great and powerful. Oh my God! Shut the up! The great and Why powerful do you need to Trixie. And not only is yourself. lifting the earth I have had it. I am putting this thing down. Well then, Trixie is putting it down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. Trixie's I'm, I'm doing gonna, it. I'm, no, I'm, I'm doing this it. I'm, I'm putting the bear down. Trixie, I'm put it. I put it out there. I put it down. Trixie. Trixie, put it down. Okay, Trixie, if this is really your doing, why don't you lift it again? Trixie, d Trixie would rather do this. Bam! Oh, oh my God! Did you see that? For the love of Trixie is unstoppable. There, it's gone. Trixie has disintegrated it. No, I sent it back to where it came from. Don't try to take credit for Trixie's impossible feats of oh magic. Oh my God! Do you want me to bring it back? Is that what you want, Trixie? Do you want me to bring it back? Trixie doesn't. Fine. Think... There, it's back. Trixie has brought it back to life! No, you didn't! You stupid little... Well, you may have bested me this time. No freaking kidding! Yeah, but I still know something you don't. Oh, really? What? Are you not left hooved? <laughs> you know nothing of what's coming. Pretty soon, things are going to change, so I'm going to give you a warning. <laughs> Beware, Twilight Sparkle. For unpleasant things stir in the south. <laughs> well, Snips, I guess we weren't destined to be in tune with the fourth. But, you know, there's always tomorrow. <laughs>